Well, you know, most of our electricity is produced by coal burning plants. And right now, the plants we have in the state are causing lots of health problems. There are lots of costs to them in terms of asthma, heart disease, uh, neurological problems in our children. And there are proposals to build eight new plants. And this is just going to magnify the existing problem. Um, you know, the issue is what, what's coming out of these plants or, or the proposed plants particulates, nitrous oxides, uh, mercury, um, the, the, nitrous, the nitrous oxides are formed in our atmosphere into ozone, also uh, a, a bad uh, pollutant. Um, and you know, the people particularly at risk are, are for example, asthmatics. We have about 900,000 asthmatics in the state. They're going to have reduced quality of life, more emergency department visits, more hospital visits, going to miss school days, going to miss work days. Um, we just can't afford uh, to, to build new plants. Uh, and, and then we, you know, people have all heard the term global warming and they think about something, oh, maybe it'll be better, it'll be warmer, or something's going to happen around the world and it's not going to affect us. But what, what will global warming mean in, in Michigan? It's going to mean more, more heat days, so our elderly who uh, adverse effects from the very hot days. It's going to mean that the, the effects of pollutants are going to be worse because the effects of particulates and ozone are worse when it's hot. We're going to have more water pollution because the way our sewer systems are set up, it's going to rain more and it's going to pollute the Great Lakes and other bodies of water. And then we're going to have more insect-borne diseases. The insects are going to be able to spread and so we're going to have more infectious diseases. We don't need new plants. There's lots of costs associated with them. There's better ways to, to produce electricity.